Well, Dan Dion, Emory High was closed today, as were all of the schools in the district after the superintendent received that threatening email. Now, I'm told the email said something about a student in need of help who had been bullied, but it turns out that email was part of some sort of competition to get schools closed and as many as possible. Squad cars in the parking lot, locked doors, and an empty campus after someone sent an email threatening to shoot students and faculty in Emeryville. So the Emory Unified School District canceled class. It was the right decision at the right time. Captain Oliver Collins with Emeryville PD says his detectives started investigating as soon as the threat came in at 10 o'clock Sunday night. There's been too many instances of uh, agencies and, and organizations not taking threats seriously or vetting them out. By Monday morning, police determined it was a hoax that originated in an online gaming community. More than 50 Bay Area school districts received the threatening email, but by the time they saw it, Emeryville PD and other law enforcement agencies had determined that it was not a credible threat, so they kept schools open. It's not a good situation. I mean, schools are making tough choices. Michelle Smith McDonald works for the Alameda County Office of Education. 13 of their school districts, including Dublin, received threats. The idea that this was a dare or some sort of of a bet or something where they wanted to frighten and sort of alarm school communities like it's it's really troubling. I think it's ridiculous. Kids are supposed to feel safe at school. Parents at Glenview Elementary in Oakland were alarmed to learn their schools were also threatened. Many feel canceling class in Emeryville was unfortunate, but in the end, a smart decision. There's been so many shootings at schools that it's better safe than sorry. Now, Emeryville PD tells me that they will have officers stationed here at Emory High and at the elementary school to ensure that everyone stays safe when they return to school tomorrow. 